And as we reported earlier, of course, the actor Rock Hudson died today of diseases related to AIDS. Many of his fellow actors and actresses are expressing their grief, of course. Tonight, Josh Hall is with Helen Hayes at a fundraiser for Meals on Wheels, and he has her reaction. Josh? Yes, Bill, this is, I'm sitting here with the first lady of the theater, Helen Hayes, and I must first mention that this is uh, for, for Miss Hayes and for the people here uh, an important evening for a number of reasons. As you mentioned, it is to raise money for Meals on Wheels. This is also her 85th birthday. And if you look behind me, you can see a cake there that's towering over us. This, the event is sponsored by Duncan Hines, among others, and that explains the cake, but it's really remarkable. Uh, in fact, we're expecting, I understand, 400 people here tonight. And you're telling me you were more nervous tonight than you, you <laughs> have been for an opening night in the yes, theater? Yes, I was. I was afraid nobody would show up. It's no. terrible to be the uh, centerpiece <laughs> of a big party that has uh, for such a great cause mm. and so generously um, uh, given by, by Duncan Hines and uh, the House of Seagram. And I couldn't let them down. I couldn't let I Commissioner Saner down, who has been running, mm. who, was, who was the genius behind Meals on Wheels. Oh, I was frightened to death. And of course, above all, I couldn't let down those mm. dear people who were waiting for us to raise mm. the money. If I may, I must turn to a more serious topic. It, it seems ironic on a night here to be talking with you, celebrating your 85th birthday, that we must talk about one of your colleagues whose life was cut tragically short at the age of 59. But if you could tell me what your thoughts are about Rock Hudson's passing. Oh, well, I suppose it's, it's, a, it's a good thing that Rock has been relieved of the, of the torture he had to go through. But it's so sad, it's so sad. He was the most delightful, charming, warm, amusing man I ever knew. Last time I had dinner with Rock, it was about two years ago, and uh, that was out in California. I don't get out there very often. But we had a wonderful evening, and uh, we got on the subject of peach ice cream, which is our <laughs> favorite. Both of us claimed that as our favorite. And he sent me a recipe for peach ice cream later. And, uh, oh, I, I just, I hate to think that he's not with us anymore. It's our loss, but I'm sure he's, he's released. Mm. One last question, if I may. What do you think this is going to hold for the, the, the industry in general? Do you think this is really going to throw a cloud over things? Oh, you mean uh, the, movie, the Rock's movie industry, uh, the, the theater industry? Perhaps for a while people will be nervous as they as they are already mm. since he was stricken um yes they'll get nervous they they panic easily mm. out there you know in that mm. industry a uh, minute there's a little bit of a mm. flurry in the stock market the things yeah. that they, everybody gets terrified and i suppose they'll be afraid for a while but then they're very gallant too because mm. they've been raising money like mad haven't they to fight this yes indeed mm -hmm. thank you very much we've, we've run out of time but thank you for being with us uh reporting live from tavern on the green with Miss Helen Hayes. Josh Howell, Channel 7 Eyewitness News, back to you. Thank you, Josh and Miss Hayes. Roger.